Soccer now, the UNOH women's team has had an outstanding season. It's just the second year for the program, but that hasn't stopped the Lady Racers from going 17-1-1. Tomorrow they will take on Siena Heights for the WAC title. And from the start of training this year, Coach Stuart Gore and the girls knew they were on to something special. I thought we had a great year last year and this year they've just the, the, the new players coming in and the old players have, have stepped up and, and really uh, took it to a whole new level and, and hopefully we can carry it on as, as long as possible. When we all came in we all kind of formed as more than just a team. We all have this bond and it's just helped us through so much. Yeah we bonded really well from the, you know, from the first day. We've all come together and we've you know, proved ourselves through the season and done really well together. UNOH hasn't only won, they've dominated this year. They shut out their opponent in 12 straight games from September 6th to October 25th. That's more than 1,100 minutes without allowing a single goal. The streak finally came to an end at Davenport in the Lady Racers' first and only loss of the season. I don't know, it just it sort of um, manifested itself and grew and grew and grew and, and next thing I know it's, uh, it's as big as what it was. We didn't want it to affect our games too much and be too over excited about trying to get another shutout. For me, I was more disappointed we lost more than the shutout streak itself. Um, so it makes you realize you're human and it made us deal with a bit of adversity as a team. And we came through that, which was which was great. Since the loss, goalie Nadine Stonejack has recorded four more shutouts and was named NAIA National Defensive Player of the Week. Offensively, Alice Coyne leads the way with 13 goals, but she credits those around her for her tallies. I mean, really, it's down to the team. You know, I wouldn't score the goals without you know them making the, the passes to me and stuff. So I think we just work really well together. I think this lot will tell you that they hate losing more than they love winning, and and they um, they understand that it, it, it's hard work. Hard work gets you there. You know, no one's going to give you anything. You have to work work your socks off every single day in practice and, and onto the field. UNOH hosts Siena Heights in the WAC title game tomorrow, and they just want to keep doing what they've been doing. I mean, really, we just need to play, you know, how we've played before, because we come out hard at the start, and I think that really um, makes us play well together as a team. And we just need to just keep going, playing how we've played. After tomorrow's contest, the Lady Racers will await their draw in the national tournament. With the UNOH women's team, I'm Matt Finkel for the Sports Report.